Hey you guys, welcome back, welcome back. So today I am going to show you how to make lemongrass. What I have in the pot so far is lemongrass that I have boiled for breakfast. And what I'm going to do now is just add some more lemongrass to it. And I'm just going to give you some quick tips on what lemongrass is actually good for in the human body. It prevents the growth of some bacteria. It has antifungal and antibacterial properties. It is also good for your acne if you have bumps and pimples and stuff like that. It is good for pain and swelling. You know, sometimes you get swelling in your feet and hands. It's good for that as well. If you have a fever, it's a very good tea to drink. If you have stress and you would like to relieve some of the stress, you know, sometimes your stress gives you migraines and headaches. It's good for that. And for my sisters, if you are on your menstrual and you have really bad menstrual pains, cramps, and things of that nature, this is a very, very good tea to consume. Um, it helps with a lot of different things. What you want to do ultimately, in my p opinion, um, I'm a mom. And I'm also um, from the Caribbean. And in the Caribbean, we have a lot of these things growing in our backyard, um, in our neighbor's yard, in our grandparents' yard. And these things are what we grew up on. Um, you know, anytime I had a headache, I would get some lemongrass. Or if I had certain pains or a cold or anything like that, I would get some lemongrass. I'd add some ginger, some cinnamon. Um, some bay leaves. There's things that we normally take that um, we don't realize until we're older how much more it is important to us to use it on a daily basis if we can. So I would say to you, if you can get the natural thing straight from the soil and not from the store, it's much better. I have a bag here with lemongrass. When you take it out, it's been dried, sun dried. And what I normally do is, you see they look just like long. What I would normally do is I would take a bit of it. I would cut it with my scissors. Oh, hey. I would cut it just a little piece with my scissors. And I would take this stalk, this branch, and I'll just put it in the pot. I'll add some water to it. Let me get my bottle of water. So I'll get my bottle of water. I'll add some water to it. And then I'll just turn the stove on and I'll just let it simmer. I'll let it boil for about um, five, 10 minutes or sometimes 15 minutes. Um, I will bring it up to a boil to a rolling boil and then once it is completely boiling I would put my fire down on really really low and just let it sit for five for an extra five ten minutes so that I can extract all that good stuff out of it my water would go from being clear to green to like a tan brown so the darker your water gets the more of the preservatives that are in the lemongrass is what you're getting and drinking and the better for you. Um, at the end of it, if you want to add some Manuka honey or whatever honey that you have at home, you can. Some cane sugar, brown sugar, you can. I wouldn't recommend putting any white sugar in there. Um, that'll take away from what you're trying to get from it, okay? And also, if... Uh, you have probably like some condensed milk, some sweetened milk. Sometimes the kids like that sweet milk. So I would add some of that in there. But ultimately, it's just cut it, boil it, let it simmer, let it sit, and drink it to your liking. Okay, you guys, just a sneak peek. It hasn't come to a complete boil yet, but it's getting there. And if you can see, the water is turning a slight green. The um, lemongrass went from a grayish, uh, brownish color 
so now you can start seeing how it actually looked before it sun dried it looked good it's looking really good y'all hey guys so I now have this up to a boil as you can see um, the color is a nice golden brown little greenish I'm going to turn my fire off. I'm going to pour my tea out. And then I am going to show you the color of the tea when I am done. Okay, you guys, we are back. So here is my cup. And as you can see, it's a beautiful golden brown color. And this is all lemongrass, you guys. I didn't add anything else but a bottle of water. And I am now about to add some of my honey that I got here. Um, so you could add as much honey as you want. I don't really take that much, but just to make it a little sweet, but that's it. Stir it around and enjoy beautiful, beautiful color. And sometimes I even put a lemongrass in my tea, as you can see. All right, guys, enjoy. I hope it helps. I hope it works. Like subscribe, please do share. And don't forget, do not stress and enjoy the rest. Bye. See you next time.